Welcome to Igor Tech Channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Windows 10 and 11 corrupted files using System File Checker. If corrupted system files are causing problems on Windows 10 or 11 PC, this guide will help you fix this issue with the System File Checker tool. On Windows PC, when you notice issues starting your desktop, random errors occur, or features don't work correctly, there is a good chance that some system files might be corrupted or missing for unknown reasons. Usually, you may experience problems with system files after installing a cumulative update or driver or making installation changes manually. Regardless of the reason, if you come across any related issues, Windows 10 includes the System File Checker, a command line tool designed to scan the integrity and restore missing or corrupted system files with working replacements. To repair an installation of Windows 10, 11, or lower version using the System File Checker tool, follow these steps. Open Start. Type CMD, right-click the top result, and select the Run as Administrator option. Type the following command to repair the Windows 10 system files and press Enter, SFC slash Scan Now. System File Checker will now verify the integrity of every protected operating system file on your computer. It might take a while to finish. When the verification process completes, you'll see something like this. Windows Resource Protection found corrupt files and successfully repaired them. This indicates that the tool detected problems and was able to fix them. Other messages are as follows. Windows Resource Protection did not find any integrity violations. This indicates that the system does not have any corrupted or missing files. Windows Resource Protection could not perform the requested operation. Indicates a problem during the scan, and an offline scan is required. Windows Resource Protection found corrupt files but was unable to fix some of them. This indicates you may need to repair the corrupted files manually. When the tool detects an issue, it is recommended to run the command around three times to ensure that all the problems have been corrected properly. To view the details stored in the cbs.log file from an SFC scan, follow these steps. On the command prompt, type the following command and press enter. When done, open File Explorer. Click on this PC from the left pane. Under the Devices and Drives section, open the local disk, the C drive. Double-click the SFC logs.txt file to open it with the default text editor app. After you complete the steps, the log file will reveal all the scanned system files and information for the unrepairable files. This covers how to fix Windows 10 and 11 corrupted files with the SFC command. If you have a question to ask, leave it in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer it. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day.